The Aboriginal Education Department of Prince Rupert School District held the Walk to Build Strength on Saturday in recognition of Residential School Truth and Reconciliation Week in Vancouver. The event was held to acknowledge Canada's history of residential schools while celebrating the strength of survivors and renewing relationships based on a shared understanding. Participants walked from Mariner's Park to the Fisherman's Hall where an event took place afterward. It was to build strength designed to transform and renew the very essence of relationships among Aboriginal people and all Canadians. The event included speeches from residential school survivors. Then they got into the policies, English only policy. I remember when I was in school, the only language I knew was my Somali language. They brought in children from Saskatchewan, Alberta, Hobima in Edmonton schools so that we could not speak the same language. They mixed us all up. I just thank God that we're still here today. We are very strong people. For years I was imprisoned in my own body. The worst thing is to have animosity, hate, unknown thoughts in your mind that you couldn't get rid of. Until I learn, unless I forgive that person, I will remain in jail. Once I let go, not what they did to me, but once I let those people go, I was free. I was free because I didn't hate them anymore. I hated what they did to me, but I didn't hate them. I was liberated. The event also included a candlelight ceremony to remember those who lost their lives at residential schools. For the Northernview.com, I'm Martina Perry.